you know where St. Paul's Cathedral is? Sorry? Saint, I'm looking for the St. Paul's Cathedral. <laughs> oh, hey, is that out there? No. Scotland is a beautiful country. It's, it's near UK. What? Hey, 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 yeah, you're right. Yeah. Great, hey, 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 Scotland, uh, where's the, uh, where, where, where the entrance is for it? Pardon? Don't you forget. When you go to Glasgow, you see, you see, you see someone out often as well. <laughs> you know. How are you, Paul? You alright, Paul? Keep it real, eh? No idea. No, no we're all idea here. what that no, was at all. <laughs> um, so we're going to cross live to London right now via video call um, to not only speak to the comedian himself, but also unveil his identity. <laughs> um, Joe, thank you for joining us. Now, I've got to say, as a proud Glaswegian, that's one of the worst Glaswegian accents I've ever heard. Are you proud of it? Uh, I think I'm very proud of it. Obviously, I was using uh, Google Glass and I needed to utilise the Glaswegian accent to create Google Glaswegian. And I thought, you know, I couldn't find a Scot to hand, so I improvised. I thought I did the best I could. <laughs> Fair enough, I suppose. Yeah, it's an attempt, it, but yeah. I have to say, we struggled to understand it, but can you understand us as Glaswegians? Do you, do you get the accent? Sorry, could you repeat the question? <laughs> 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 like like oh, so, someone that, must yeah. be emailing you what we're saying so that you can understand us. Is that what's going on, Joe? Subtitles going up across the screen. Um, the reaction yeah, I, love, I love Scots. Love the Scots. Yeah. It wasn't, a, it wasn't a dig at all. I love the Scots. Can't wait to get there in August. Right, so uh, was that just your own interpretation of the Glaswegian accent or have you heard a fair few Glaswegian accents? Well, growing up I used to, my first introduction to the Glaswegian accent was to Rapsi Nesbitt. I didn't realise it was a comedy, I thought it was sort of a harrowing documentary, but I grew to <laughs> sort of realise in time that, you know, they've got a very succinct style of speaking and I've grown to love it. Good choice, Rapsi. Absolutely. Sort of style your comedy on him, that it's not a bad thing. But what's the reaction been like online? Because we've said it there, it's gone viral. Like, so many people have watched it. Did you expect that? Well, no, you could never expect it. It's quite an old video and it kind of got a bit of steam in the past week. But the reaction has been okay. But I'm concerned I have offended the entire <laughs> Scottish population. I think you may have. Yeah. And on that subject, <laughs> you're a brave man because you're coming to Scotland in August to the, uh, to the Edinburgh Festival. That's right. I may be wearing Kevlar for my forearm, but you know, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Very quickly, so that you can actually come to the festival, to claim back the Scottish audience, Joe, we've given you two phrases. Did you get them OK? Yes, you have. Right, give us, I have. Give us I'm those, looking at them now. Right, give us those two phrases if you can. OK, the first one is... Hold your wishy! Hold your wish, not your wishy. I don't know what your wishy is. I don't want to know what your wishy is. <laughs> and the second one? Okay, next one is. <clears throat> you're doing me hidden! Oh, <laughs> no, you're doing my hidden. Listen, Joe. Improvement. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Away you go and hold your wish and we'll see you at the festival. See you in August. Thank <laughs> you very so. much. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Now, right. You're wishing? I know. Who knows? Who knows?